It's October 17th, 2020. Please pardon the highway noise. The garden is about done for the year. You can see, you know, we did get bell peppers. This one's all limp. This one's just getting composted. We got different kinds of bell peppers this year and other things. I didn't make as many gardening videos as I normally do. My wife just came out and picked some of the some of the vegetables here from the garden. These uh, these snacking peppers were really good. They're mild. And we still got some stuff growing here. We might get lucky with the frost that we keep getting. It's probably going to kill off everything, but I might be able to pick something. Yeah, see, this one's... If I cut it up tonight, I could use it, but only part of it. I believe this, these were Mexabels here. The Serranos did really good. I picked some and actually cut them up and froze them. Doesn't look like a, there's any left. The uh, mystery peppers did start to start to produce here, but didn't really get that far. I just crowded them in there. I just kind of just to see what would happen. I'll probably throw a bunch of seeds down next year and just see what happens. The corn was uh, somewhat of a, a success and a failure. And uh, as you can see, I had tomatoes come up right into the corn there. That's because I had composted or I had uh, kind of um, dug up the garden everywhere this year and sort of just blended all the dirt in together and then spread it all out. So I had cilantro and tomatoes come up, probably seeds from last year. But I, I did get some corn this year. I learned a little bit from it. It's the first time I was able to successfully harvest it. As usual, the green onions grew all over the place. I had to had to move some of the extra ones over here because I just didn't have room. But uh, yeah, the green onions always do good. The raspberries came up later than normal, but I mean, you can see my wife was picking some today. So pretty good. Some of my other peppers. Here's the culapeno. Some of these I could pick. Some of this is from me neglecting the garden towards the end of the year. I didn't I didn't uh, water enough. The corn that I planted over there that failed. And that's uh, the second time I planted corn over there. It's a location, I think. The marigolds did did really good. I'd say this year the tomato plants that I bought, or the seeds that I planted, didn't do as well as the seeds that were just sort of left over from last year. You see, these are my Mexabels, and those are the uh, garden salsa peppers. I managed to, to uh, harvest some of those and they did pretty good. Cilantro came up everywhere, but I didn't use it all. Actually, I feed some of this to my reptiles. These green onions, I might be able to harvest a few more this year, but they're, they're pretty much done. I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna just cut them all down and just leave the the roots down there and just cover them in leaves i bet they'll just come right back up in the spring the green beans didn't do as well as i thought but they did okay i could have i could have done a better job of watering them and gotten better results and the squash and cucumber watermelon jack-o-lanterns things like that they just didn't take off i've got one stalk of celery left i bought the celery at the store bought the celery at the store uh, it was already uh, this bonnie plant already kind of growing and planted it never grew celery before and it turned out really good I think I want to try to grow celery from seed next year and just see what happens but I might be rearranging the garden I'm really not too sure what happens is the weather starts to get warm I've been trapped in the house because of the winter I get outside I start doing projects around the house and I get really zealous about working on the garden at some point I get busy with other things or maybe we travel or something like that and I have a tendency to find it harder and harder to make time for the garden 
but I do enjoy gardening. This year I just, I don't think I did as good of a job as I could have. I don't think I put as much into it as, as I could have, but I'm not, I'm not upset about it. I was able to harvest uh, peppers and that's good enough for me for right now. So it'll be interesting to see what next year holds, but for right now, I'm closing out the garden for the year. If anything that I get is, is just sheer luck. I, I've gotten as far as uh, uh, Veterans Day, November 11th in the past. So there's still a chance something might pop up, but for the most part, it's done. It, it's gotten cold here. We turned the heat on for the first time today. So yeah, winter's here. See you next year. Thanks for watching. Well, this isn't quite the jungle, and this isn't quite a katana. Let's see if I can cut this down. There we go. The last of the fresh celery.